modest offering from those few surrounding farms as yet untouched by the spreading calamity. Alright, so we're almost done with the checklist on uh, getting classes to level 6. So, so that's nice. It's only gonna budge a little bit. We could go for a second bumper crop. Berserk charm. Wrathful bandana. Minus healing, but more damage. What's this? The magic conch shell? 40% healing received. That's kind of neat. But it's only that, so I don't know. There are many better things I would want more than just healing received. Flagellant. I do not want to tempt fate again. Screw this thing. It's not worth my time. Hmm. Oh, wait, disease resist is related to Crimson Curse? Ah. Hmm. Is there anything I want? Nah, no, I think I just. Nah, uh, actually, I think I'll leave that out for now. Uh, wait. Is anyone else diseased? I forget. Uh, no one else is diseased. You have the yips. Just heal, range, skill up, blah, blah. Uh, just go remove, remove that. You'll be out of commission for a while. Xenophobia, beast hater, feather fighter. Eh. Uh, nocturnal. I kind of want to get rid of that, actually. But I think I need to stress heal you first. We'll definitely get rid of Clumsy. Because... Yeah, I mean, you you have a decent amount of... Actually, no, you have... Alright, you have low amounts of dodge. You're at base 20 with compared to most people. You can handle any foe. Oh, do you want to go to the darkest dungeon right now? Because uh, I can arrange that for you. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, but let me see. Are you... Risk taker? Okay, you can go anywhere. You cannot gamble. So how about we just... Actually, no. Minute Oh, no. It's the same price either way. Eh, how about you guys go party and have a drink? Alright, and since we're almost done leveling up, people... Let's try out the... Oh, wrong one. Let me... Hmm, what do I want to do? Actually, this one's a short one. I can go for it. Or I can get the bumper crop again. And then once... Once the uh, meter fills... Then we can decide on... Actually, no, wait, uh... Mm, I would have to go for it right away. Yeah, let me see. I can try out the position for... Uh, Men at Arms. So, where is it? Where is it? Right. Guardian Shield. So, extra healing received, then protection and dodge. And Toughering, I guess? Since you're not going to be damaging anyways from P4? Sure. And how about we bring in... Bring in Patchy. Uh, how about we bring in... Vestal. I'm not sure which one I want to bring in. Uh, probably... I want with Hippocratic. And who's gonna be our position one? I think I might want to bring in. Uh... Oh right, I need to treat you too, Cav. 
Uh, minus 10 accuracy versus blighter when you blight the hmm. Yeah, I think I'll bring in another shield breaker or something like that. Maybe I'll bring in summer. Yeah, actually you have warrant scrounger too. Yeah, sure. I think that'll do. That'll do quite nicely. Ancestor's Pen would probably do do good here. Ancestor's Pen or Crescendo Box. Ah, uh, actually Crescendo Box. So in terms of weapons and armor, we got our final upgrades here. Give me that speed up. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to use Bellow as well. Hmm. So I can keep guarding. Be the buff bot. I know that's like a lot of money I burned, but sure. Actually, let me see if there's anything I can sell that I don't really use. Or don't really want to use at any immediate moment. I mean to death, but couldn't curse. Oh, uh, yeah. You know, I think I'll sell the rat carcass because, for the most part, I already have a good supply of blood. I'm never going to any place that's in the Crimson Court. Uh, without at least one stack of blood, and if anything, I'll just retreat. Yeah, this is kind of useless to me. And let's see, anything else? I mean, like, there are the other ancestor items that I could probably sell off, but mm, keep the handkerchief just in case. Uh, if it was the mustache cream, sure, I'll ditch that in a heartbeat, but this one... Hmm... Although I haven't used the tentacle idol in a while, because it relies on virtue chance and getting to 100% stress. Uh... Hmm... Maybe I should, uh, maybe I should sell these and... Get some more money. Because... Like, in what situations would I really want bleed resist over anything else I have here at the moment? Also disease resist. Although, I guess... I guess if I'm fighting... Certain bosses or enemies like the swine... Or... Or among other things, the disease resist would be nice. But, uh, lead resist. I was finding bandits, so let's see. Bandits, cultists, certain other enemies in the cove, if I remember correctly. So, like those guardians. Um. Crimson Court, eh. Some bleed, but a lot of them tend to blight or just do some other stuff instead of bleeding. Yeah, actually, because if I look at everyone's resistances, like, pretty much 90 is the base for what's considered standard for bleed resist at this rate. So if anything's below that, 
like with the leper maybe with the leper I would usually prioritize other items instead like I don't know the last one testament and a focus ring or something or another so I wouldn't really put the handkerchief on Anyone else with kind of eh, bleed and disease resist that would really want to put on? Oh yeah, I need to remove anemic someday. Yeah, I pretty much don't really need it. All right, all right, I'll go sell it. And tentacle idol. Like the times I did bring this when I didn't have any other thing in my inventory, this was kind of. Lackluster. I never got virtue chances when I really needed it. Even though, like at base, you have twenty five, and this boosts it to forty five percent. Still not enough to justify bringing this. Yeah, I think I'll. Uh, I think I'll sell this too. Because for all I know, the shrieker could just come out of nowhere again and steal more of my stuff. So, might as well convert it to gold now. And the heads here, I'll just keep them because if I find secret rooms, I kind of want the uh, loot crystals more than getting this again. Because at any time, when you get one, when you ditch one of these, or basically if you're missing any of these, you will always get, or I'm pretty sure you always spawn one of these things that you're missing and not get the crystal that's worth 3500. If I get an ancestor design, will it show up later? Oh yeah, yeah. It it's it, uh, it's shown up on uh, frequent uh, occasions. Like uh, the mustache cream has come up so many times, at least three times already. Uh, I've sold them all because blight resist and debuff resist aren't really. I mean, some debuffs are nasty, but it's like inconsistent when I would need that. But yeah, I've sold it off so many times already. Got a good amount of money. Vessel's all good, you're all good. Summer. Yeah. They're pretty good here. Oh, wait, anything in. Anything in the wagon? Eh. You know, I don't know if I should even bother upgrading. Actually, do I want to save up for anything or do I just want to use my crest now at this point? Torchlight. I mean, more loot is nice, but eh, I don't feel like it. Healing when eating. I'll get there eventually. And respite. Hmm. I mean, it's not like I'm really going out to buy anything in particular. Sanitarium, though. I would like to get one step closer to finishing up patient cells. Because all I have is the uh, granary. Hmm. Although if I do upgrade these, I guess I'll... No, I, I, I guess I'll keep holding on to these and... Whether or not I need to treat three people at a time, I guess I'll upgrade it when I need it. Alright, so let's see, let's go for the bumper crop again. And look at all this free stuff! I know I'll take it anyways. <laughs> okay, okay, I really don't need this much. Alright, in terms of uh, other items, swap. Exploration items go here, coach go here. Uh. Get our torches, autonoms. Uh, we haven't encountered shrieks before, or ghouls, I mean. Hmm. That's super important. Yeah, 
Yeah, sounds good. Let's go. Alright. Let's see how this goes with the uh, support man at arms. Because uh, for the most part, I've used men at arms uh, near the front lines. Even the fiercest beast will lay oh, down God. when it's not eaten. Steal their food. Okay, okay. So we can wrap around and burn through our resources for this last grain here, and we got a secret room right off the bat. Secret room right off the. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Because in case anything goes bad, at least I'll come away with something good. Sweet. I'll take that. Ornaments, neatly ordered, lovingly right. admired. That right, was the first battle gonna be. Ah, oh, come on. Ah, oh, come on. Why, why, why do you do this to me? Ah, oh, come on. I don't have any blood on me. You're one-off lethal. You know what? Screw you. Her death by inches. Oh my god, the man-at-arms is so slow. Five speed is so god awful. Even even the supplicants with three speed are going ahead because they rolled higher on the initiative. So slow. Is there a point to using bolster right now? Uh, let me think. I can debuff their dodge. I can buff accuracy and crit. Or give everyone dodge. No, no, actually, no. I'll use minus stress if I find stress encounters. So for now, I think this would be a better choice. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. No, oh, you're fine. You're fine. How? Do this. Okay, he's dead. Nice. The slow death, unforeseen, unforgiving. Uh, well, I can't really do anything else. Uh, might as well bump up the dodge. Duh. Oh, oh, resisted. Oh, you're gone. Surges as the enemy crumbles. Not rain books. Rains for yellow bellies. Uh oh, it's summer. You can go for it right now. Nice. Turn one. Go for you two. Get the bleed stacks going right away. We can't stun the back line. Fifteen percent. Or reduce dodge. Well, we're gonna get our accuracy buffed anyways, eventually. 15%? Damn it. <laughs> Are you gonna rush? No, you're retreating. Oh no. Oh boy. Everyone better dodge this. Actually, can I pull you? Oh no, no, you have zero percent chance to pull. Oh no. Oh no. Actually, no, you're dead. Great is the weapon oh wait, does that mess up your own. rush? Because you have to be touching P4, right? Compassion oh my god, ten heal on Divine Comfort. That's so good. Hmm. I don't really need to do that. A time to perform beyond one's limits. Oh, it still rushes. Oh! Oh, the dodge is actually worth it. It actually did something. Hooray. I 
let him bleed. We get a cheeky stun. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna eliminate so we can get more torch. In radiance, may we find victory. Guess uh, maybe I'll protect someone. Maybe the vestal. Backhand. Ah, the backhand. Dodge tanking like a god. We're done. Champion falls. Okay. This expedition at least promises success. Uh ditch this. I want bus. Two food. No one's missing one health, so we don't really need it. Rubies. Uh Hmm. Nah, I guess in terms of gold, like, we're all set. We don't really need any more gold than this. Sure. Is there any point to doing this, or is it just food only? Ah, just food only. I mean, I have enough medicinal herbs that I can afford to sack one, so... I wanna double check that. Alright, another battle. Hmm. Not too bad. Okay, I can impale here. Because the bleed will definitely kill this. Ooh, high rolls. Uh, chance of stun is very small, but we got nothing else to do. The tide turns. It resisted. Uh, do we bolster? Hmm. You don't really think I'll need keys since I already got the secret room? Uh, I guess you're right. Uh, I can't remember, do I still get loot if I try to open up the heirloom chest without a key? Because I know there's the, the chance for the trap, but is it always a guaranteed trap? Or is it just like, less loot than usual? I guess I'll guard someone. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. Oh, hey. Ah, uh, it's less loot sometimes a trap. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna keep the keys. I mean, it's like, you know, you'll never know These until it happens. Can be felt. They can be beaten. So, I think I'll just keep this much, because, let me see, this is 7,000, 1050, or, no, 10,500, 10,500, basically 12 point something K. Jump change at this point. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. Mm. Paid for in blood. I mean, we could just keep these and ditch the gold because gold is worth less than a full stack of gems, even with onyx, if we happen to find that much somehow. Still gonna keep the torches because we will because I don't want to keep forcing my Vestal to keep using torches on every- or keep using, a uh, Illumination on every fight. Uh... Yeah. Sure. So, I guess we're not taking any more gold at this point. Like, I'm content with the stuff we found. Oh, hey! Oh boy, oh boy, what- what do I give up now? Uh... Okay, fine, fine. <laughs> uh... 
Or maybe it's maybe I should just ditch the keys, like you mentioned. Because we already we already got our money's worth. Actually, everything is free, but ah, uh, yeah, sure. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. Uh, bad trap. Ah, it's not whatever. The way is lit. The path is clear. Ooh, big boy. You require only the strength to follow it. Uh, impale will get me. Actually, if I impale and rain of sorrow. Wait, impale chance for blight is basically zero. Five to ten. Sixty-seven percent chance, or. <sighs> You know, no, no, not percent chance, uh, reduced damage. Hmm. Nah, nah, it'd probably be just worth it, just go for straight damage. Then we do this. Press disadvantage. Give them no quarter. Do I dare stun the big boy? Yeah, sure, I mean, what else do I do this turn? Damn it. Forty percent. Uh, I'm gonna have to guard uh place a guard on you. Uh I wanna use my other buff, but you're marked. Okay, so if I can do damage five I need to do at least eight or more. Sure. Damn it. Oh, I still apply blight. Wait, how did I do that? Oh, because the blight skill chance on here increases to 160. Oh, I applied it on a 20% chance. He's dead. Alright, calculated. Now we can lay into this guy. Ah, oh, you resisted both. Aw, oh, that sucks. Maintain the offensive. Let's get the dodge up. Okay, now that I've seen this in action for like a couple battles now, I feel so bad that I completely dissed uh, any attempt at showing off, or not showing off, uh, Utilizing support man at arms. He's already proven his usefulness to me right now. The ground quakes. And we don't need protection, speed and dodge. No, I always have good accuracy, especially if I buff them, so. I still kinda wish that uh Retribution or eh, maybe not Rampart, but I, I kind of wish Retribution was a position four thing. Even though it doesn't really make sense since you're technically all the way in the back, you can't exactly repost against someone when you're that far back. I guess I don't know, but I mean, I wish he had something like he can. He doesn't do any, have any use in, or like he has zero offensive capabilities. But I kind of wish like I had the option to choose between these two. That would have been so nice. Although that would make him a little bit, I guess, too strong. Because I believe in the past people have told me that the uh, the man at arms has been has been nerfed on several occasions. I think. Was it regarding his base damage or some certain skills? I don't remember. But yeah. Impressive. Geo throw. <laughs> yeah, I, I would. I would be perfectly fine with the shield throw. <laughs> Captain America. Yeah, I think I'll heal here. Captain Man at Arms. <laughs> a victory. You're gonna go, Cav. Have a nice night, Cav. 
Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the stream tonight. Oh, it's trapped. Oh, we actually got blighted. Here we go. We have one quest location. We have yet to find the third one. So we'll continue on this path. 70, 60, 80. I forgot, are you a kleptomaniac? Or are you just a manic for money? Oh no, obsessed with material things. Curio, curio. Okay, so far I'm liking that there are no battles. Oh, that means these rooms will definitely have to be battles, or I would say at least, at least two of them will be battles. Heirlooms. A fortune, waiting to be spent. Ah, sure. I'll take them for once. We're doing pretty good on torch levels now. And I think if we can scout any more, surprising. These tunnels predate even the early. Like, if we can settlers. scout for, from, or not from, uh, to these two points, I can ditch my shovels. Uh, dare I do this? Sure. Cause you need holy water for that. Why do you need holy water for a bunch of bones, anyways? Because, uh, you would think that if there was something dirty, you'd use anti-venom or distant herbs, but... Holy water? Unless they view it as a sign of evil. Of some sort. Alright, I think I'll cut by here, because we know that this is one of them. This could be another, but... Let's go cut around... Here instead. Drop. Uh, not bad. Lie in wait. We're not gonna touch that. Thirsting for blood. Oh, it's a good thing I put out the torch. No, we still got surprised. Hmm. Let's say we go for the witch. Press on incantation, good dodge. Oh no, he's setting up for the oh. Fifteen percent. Ah. Is struck. A blazing star is born. I need to get back to P four. Big spear. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Ugh. So the cultists can keep setting up for the swine champion. This is a good thing I have a damn good heal. No. The back line? No, you're one off lethal. Damn. Oh, yeah, we resist. Okay, yeah, we're definitely gonna need a, a dodge up. The blood quickens. God, that instant setup for a pig spear, too. Oh, no, he, he's going for it. Oh no. Uh, impale. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Oh boy, we better get ready. Brace for impact. Actually, wait. Does that mess it up? Them all. And dodge. Ah, oh, fuck accuracy. Inspiration. And improvement. Ooh. And a stun too.
Oh, the backhand. Okay, resisted the stuns though. Okay. No more corpses. Keep the damage on. I don't want to delay with the block. I don't want to bother. Man, that's so good. like masterfully executed. Hey, we landed the 50%. The nice. bigger the beast, the greater the glory. The greater the loot. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Ah, damn. We, we don't have any uh scouting yet. But what about the portraits now? Oh, uh, you know what? We don't we don't need the medicinal herbs anymore. Sure, sure. Let's finally take some portraits for once now that we're here. Actually, I swear to God. Under gold, jump change. Ah. Oh. All right. I think about camping. Yeah, I, I was gonna think about camping soon. Uh, I just wanted to save the camp. Or I usually like on good runs. If the run's going well enough, I'll just hold on to the camp until we get like one somewhat problematic encounter, and then just have a feast to stress heal everyone and make the most out of it, so that the downtime, in case like or the downtime after a mission is minimal. So, because I don't want to camp early, and then at the end, people will still be at like 50, 60 stress, so... Yeah, pretty much. Like, I just do celebratory camping more than actual, like, emergency camping and all. Let's see, 16... Nah, nah, that's not even gonna kill. I wonder. Three. No, no, two. No, that's only if I crit. Well, on one way to find out. Actually, wait, is this the uh, same damage mod? Damn, no crit. And let's do a dodge up because Flesh Eater here. Nice! Precipitates a dizzying fall. Oh, hey. Yeah, the grain's here. Nice. Alright, we're feasting. Gathered close in tenuous firelight, an uneasy companionship. It is so nice that the shoebreaker gets uh gets a buff during every camp. Alright, so we definitely need to prevent a nighttime ambush. Uh, armor piercing? Not really. Guess we can go for protection. Uh, extra damage up. Extra dodge. Uh, well, we're not much for damage. Hmm, might as well get more dodge up. And we're done. I was just stack dodge for the rest of this dungeon. The light, the promise of safety. Ah, oh, come on. Mechanical hazards. Damn it. Possessed by evil intent. Um, uh, battle? No. Hmm. 
Hmm. I'd say we can dish the anti venom now. Ah. Come on. Curious is the trap maker's art. His efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. Ah, here it is. The raving madman and the heaver. Where do I go for first? The stress guy or the one that can give diseases and stress? Because this one's a party-wide stressor, but this I don't like the dealing with diseases and having people out of commission for a week. Ah, uh, you know what? F the madman. Please. No! Dodge! No! No! Even the heaver dodged! 20% the dodge, man. Okay, we, we, we got a bolster. Oh no, here here it comes boys. Oh for god's sake, he has his speed is so fast. Uh because it's so inconsistent on whether or not they say that there's a battle at a quest location. Because they have like room battles with Kirio, and then when there's a Kirio but no room battle, they just say Kirio. And all that stuff, but they don't mention if there's a battle or not here. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have three people out of commission next time. I don't have any stress healers, which really sucks. A decisive pummeling. Oh, did we mess it up for him? Are you still gonna pick spear? A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Okay, he isn't. That's still a lot of damage. God, what is that stun rate? Because even with 120, you still get stunned. So it was a, like a 160? I don't know, he has like a 40% chance. Actually, I don't know, like, I'm just spitballing random numbers with nothing to base it on, but it has to be really high. Or that or I'm really unlucky because 120 stun. Hmm. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Also, yeah, I don't have the. Endure skill, so I can't stress heal other people, unfortunately. You know, like, I never ended up uh, using this. Uh, in hindsight, I should have put on Endure, but oh well. Hindsight, man. I, I should really be bringing this more often. I kind of wish you can change your skill, like, on turn zero before anyone does anything. But, I mean, that would probably make game a little bit too easy with being able to adjust too much on the fly but man or at the very least fix being or fix the thing so you can actually change skills while camping i got screwed over on so many nightmares because i forgot to change to expose while i'm camping and you would think that camping would be the best time to prepare for your next encounters so i'm like come on uh, all the little annoyances with darkest dungeon man or mild inconveniences and all that also why are you healing less Feels like you're healing less than usual. I don't know. Well struck. RNG man. Go 
course, Patchy's the one to get crit healed, so he went at zero stress. Your size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Alright. Any secret things? Here we go. What's this? Ooh, backpack. Gimme. There's still one extra thing I want to grab as well. Ooh, lore. You know, this is a very rare chance to actually obtain some lore. And I guess we don't need shovels anymore at this rate. At least the game lets me swap between eight different skills in Pokemon you only get four. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's true. Then you have to go through a little annoying process on uh, finding the move forgetter or relearner, whatever they are to get moves or something. Then I'm having to purchase or find TMs and all that as well. Also annoying. Ah, oh, really? Alright, we're done. Our supplies are replenished. The soldiers will feast tonight. Huh. I got an achievement called Caretaker. Aw, oh, Patchy got a disease. Aw. Oh. oh wait, is the Caretaker because I got everyone to level 6? Dipsomania, natural- Ah, oh, no! Summer replaced accuracy up for reducing armor upgrades when you're at max upgrade already. Uh. Hmm? Oh, hey, Quick Dragon. Does this expansion have a mod where my character looks like an anime waifu? Uh, no, it's not a. It's not an expansion for this uh, particular skin. It's a mod that I got from the Steam Workshop for anime skins. The Flagellum looks pretty nice. Ooh, <gasps> tough. Oh, I'm locking this in. Fits. Yeah, I'm taking that out. Uh, Klepto... Ah, oh, no, not Kleptomaniac. Ah, oh, no, I'm getting rid of that. Mankind Hater Precise Striker. Why can't I get a Precise Striker with other people? Of course, I can get it on a Vestal. But yeah, if you want to look at some of the other anime skins, Quicks, so, uh, I got some right here. From those few surrounding farms also, let me double check. Uh, what was climate. that achievement that I got? Was it just because I got everyone to level 6? Oh no. Complete all caretaker goals. Wait, I did? Oh no, these are quest goals. Oh, I guess... No, wait, wait. Huh. Because I still didn't depose of the Countess or Sleep or do the Darkest Dungeon yet. Or the other bosses. Hmm. But if you want to look at the other uh, skins that I got quicks, like... So here's the Flagellant. Looks pretty nice compared to the uh, base skin here where you get some dude. Oh, I'm kind of biased. I love my anime. And uh, unfortunately the Vesta doesn't have any good skins that I came across. And some of the random ones are just really... Eh. Like all the, oh, sexy Vestal skins, and it's just like, just showing a, like either bare chest or just like brawl. Like, really? At least make it look more decent than that. <laughs> Nothing for the men at arms from what I've seen that look good to me. And then here's like one of the Hellion skins. I'm not sure if this is anyone in particular, but some cat girl of sorts, I believe. You got UMP. Uh, I'm forgetting, uh, UMP45, I believe, from Gross Frontline as the Highwayman. And then we got Reimu from, uh, Toho, Tohovania specifically, with, uh, the skin. Looks really, <laughs> really intimidating. And then, uh, I'm not sure, uh... Oh, you don't know what the name is seen that cat girl for? Oh, wait, you've seen this person before? Yeah, I'm not sure where this person came from. I'm sure if you look up, uh... 
I'm pretty sure they might be on the page where uh, this is on the Steam Workshop. Maybe there's a source part in the description on where this character is from. I'm not sure where this pers where this enemy goes from though. Uh, he does look kind of jail though. But uh, anyways, I believe you got. Oh wait, the design was used for a boat in Azure Lane too. Wait, you mean I installed Heresy? Okay, I know what I have to do. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we also got. Uh, Sakia from Toho, specifically Tohovania, because she has a thing with knives, so it'd be fitting to give her a class with knives as well. Wait, outside of the skins, is the game the same? Oh yeah, yeah, the game is completely vanilla, aside from skins, because I've never beaten the Darkest, du Darkest Dungeon before, or, like, this is the furthest I've ever gotten in any of my times playing Darkest Dungeon. So, I don't want to mess with the vanilla experience with any different classes or whatnot. But yeah, we also got uh, Jean of Arc as the Crusader here. Looks really nice as well. You're in Darkest Dungeon 3 pretty hard. Oh, you mean the third quest for Darkest Dungeon? Uh, I haven't touched the Darkest Dungeon quest yet, so I don't know what to really expect. But... I kind of want to take care of, uh, not this one, uh, I want to take care of all the remaining bosses before I take on the Darkest Dungeon to kind of complete everything. Oh yeah, also we got a uh, Tomoe uh, from uh, Fade Ground Order here, it looks pretty neat, neat as well. In some attacks, uh, she actually whips out a bow and shoots it. The third assault. Hmm, I wonder what, what? Or, I wonder what I need ready to prepare for the Darkest Dungeon. Although, I'm pretty sure, like, I'm as prepared as I can be. So... Oh yeah, also, if you're familiar with Nier Automata, we got a 2B uh, Bounty Hunter skin. Although, funnily enough, I have barely used the Bounty Hunter in this entire playthrough. Like, criminally underutilized the Bounty Hunter. I blame... Having the Jester and the Shield Breaker for being pretty much my most used classes out of any of my other classes combined. Well, actually, aside from Vestal. But yeah, like, Vestal, Shield Breaker, Jester, they're all too good for me to not use. Unless, like, they're just not available. Like, my next favorite would be the... The Plague Doc. Oh yeah, with Plague Doc we also got another uh, Cat Girl skin as well. Pretty nice. Also, when uh the Plague when this Plague Doctor uses a skill, uh or uses Noxious Blast, she actually whips out like a spray can to spray some kind of poison on people, which is pretty funny. Okay, but let me take care of some stuff here. All right, so who's going? Who's going where? Summer, Armor Tinker, I don't know, not you. Okay, we're locking in tough. I think we're removing your weak grip. There we go. We're, take, we're removing Kleptomaniac. Screw this. Best Pepper Spray. Ah, same thing. Not really. Uh, remove Kleptomaniac because I'd like my loot. And we're gonna need, I believe we need 10, 20, yeah, we'll need a lot more bus if we want to unlock this. So, hold off on that. We're a little, we're, we're close enough to getting the granary, which would kind of help with some food costs a little bit. Although it's a little bit late to get that, I mean, we're in week 88, for God's sake. I would have game over it at this point. If I was playing on Stygian mode. Ugh, no, no good flagellants yet to make up for the one we lost. Faded, Eagle Eye, Sign. Si really? Weak grip on. Ugh, no, nah, no, nah, screw that. Impulsive, off guard. Not worth it. 
Although we do have a flagellant here, but uh oh, only worth taking level three. It'll cost way too much to grind up. Alright, and we got the swine god here. Ooh. Ooh, Wilbur's flag. We get this new Wilbur's flag. 50% stun resist and 10 Yo! That would be so nice. Uh, let's see, who is not stun resistant? Yeah, like, jesters, like anyone with 80% 80, 80 stun resist. This would be amazing on them. Oh yeah, let me look at my other choices, what do we got? Abomination. Leper. More focus rings I don't need. Virtue chance, not that important. Uh, but of course... Of course, when we can unlock the fight for a swine god, the thing is here. No, I fought it once. Someone died, or Cav died once for it. It was due to the stress and then heart attack at zero HP. God, uh... Like, I'd have to go- like, I'd have to make a team specifically for fighting the thing and the swine god at the same- at the same time. Actually... Let me- let me see. Hey, I can still use Summer. Yeah, you're still pretty good. Still pretty good too. I definitely want a Jester at this point. And maybe... Who's still under level? Ah, oh, no, that's... Mm. Someone that can... I might just bring in a Leper again. Oh wait, no, no, Solomon's in the... Oh, no, 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 Solomon's still here with us. I think, like, this planet, because I just want raw damage. Or maybe I can just bring in... Oh, wait, actually... Actually, it's a good thing we, we replaced, uh, Deadly. Actually, was it Deadly that I replaced? Yeah. So actually, because we we have Beast Hater, this is perfect for the Swine God. Because Fairweather Fighter, if we can stay at 100% health, we can use Beast Hater, Slugger, Risk Taker. Give me that, like, 25, wait, 10, 25, 35, 55% damage up. I think I'll take it. Although, wait, what's making this say 30? Oh, wait, is it because of... Uh, oh, no, not Slugger. Is it because of Risk Taker and Fairweather? Probably. Let's see, how do I equip you, though? Hmm. Eh, I guess I'll decide on that later. Because, uh, I think I'm done for tonight, guys. It's a little bit- or it's getting a little bit late, and I know I started the stream late and everything. But, uh, eh, I don't want to go too late on this. I think I'll save the Swine God for tomorrow. So anyways, I think I'm gonna go exit out here, guys.